how lifestyle medicines like weed can affect your fitness. Negative impacts. Smoking a joint with thick smoke and making smoke rings along with getting high sounds cool and intriguing. But apart from looking cool, it kills you on the inside. Hello and welcome to another episode of Health Shadow. Don't forget to hit the subscribe button, leave a comment, a thumbs up, and hit the bell notification so you don't miss out on any upcoming videos. In today's video, we are going to learn how weed can affect your health and fitness. Some countries have legalized weed, while many countries still consider it a crime to smoke or possess weed. This is due to the uncountable harmful effects weed has on your fitness and your health. So let's have a look at all the damage marijuana can do to your body. Number 1. Bad for the lungs Well, this one is pretty obvious, isn't it? If you smoke something, you can't expect that your lungs won't be affected by that. Smoking cannabis has the same effects on your lungs as smoking cigarettes or smoking anything else. Well, it is a little less harmful than smoking tobacco, but you can't give a green signal to cannabis too. It may not cause lung cancer like tobacco can, but it could cause other respiratory issues, breathing problems, cough, and much more. An excess of everything is bad. I'm not saying that you smoke 10 joints in a day for a year and still you won't get lung cancer. You would definitely get lung cancer. Don't come crying to me if you get lung cancer. <laughs> Number 2. Motivational Issues If you are an athlete, lack of motivation is the last thing you want to deal with. And not only with athletes, but for everyone. Every single person runs on motivation. Lack of motivation will depress you because you won't have the will to do your work. Lying all day in your bed because you have no motivation to get up will make you even more stressed. The thoughts of not being productive will haunt you. Scary story, isn't it? Well, all these things can happen to you if you smoke marijuana regularly. Research has shown that people who consume cannabis on a regular basis have very low motivation of doing anything. This actually is a very scary thought. You get high and your motivation goes low. I mean, this could lead you to an existential crisis from which getting out is not that easy. Number 3. Weed and Gym Some people occasionally smoke a joint before going to the gym. But if this becomes a regular habit, that's the problem. Marijuana is a big hurdle in transformation and muscle gains. Regular smokers of cannabis have very low reaction time. They often feel back pains, headaches, and overall a lower level of strength in their bodies. Due to all this, they often face poor muscle and mind connection and an enormous reduction in stamina and exercise capacity. Regular marijuana smokers often exhaust in no time when it comes to any physical activity. This is the direct and also the prolonged usage effect of weed on workout and performance. Do you find all this very useful? I'm sure you didn't think cannabis could be this harmful, right? Well, stick till the very end of the video to know some more jaw-dropping disadvantages of marijuana. Number 4. Affects your heart If you are a smoker, you must have noticed that while smoking, your heart beats a little faster. Well, that is the case for smoking marijuana as well. Smoking marijuana causes your heart rate to speed up, due to which your heart is forced to work harder. These effects only last while you smoke, but if you smoke too much marijuana, this increased heart rate can become your 24-7 condition, which obviously increases your chance of a heart attack. In fact, let me give you an inside. Research shows that risk of heart attack can increase up to five times within the first hour after smoking marijuana. Frequent marijuana use among young people increases risk of stroke compared with those who don't do weed. If you made it till here, please don't forget to subscribe to the channel and press the bell icon to stay updated with our latest videos. Anyways, let's proceed. Number 5. Weak Bones I can quote many studies here. But to quote one from 2017, smoking marijuana on a daily basis weakens your bones and reduces bone density. This research says 
that people who have smoked marijuana more than 5,000 times their lives have a 5% lower bone density than those who haven't smoked this much. Do you know what bone density is? Let me tell you. You must have seen people complaining about joint pains, back pains, and other bone pains. And to treat these pains, they take calcium tablets and whatnot. Well, that is actually due to reduced bone density, due to lack of calcium mainly. Smoking marijuana burns the calcium in your bones and makes your bones weak. Weak bones can cause you unbearable pains and they can be easily fractured. Number 6. Effects in Pregnancy Well, if you are a pregnant woman, whatever you do to your health, you'll do that to your child's health as well. So be careful. As harmful as marijuana is to any human, it's more harmful for pregnant women. It causes serious issues to the baby's health as well as the mother's health. Babies of marijuana addicted mothers are normally underweight and are prematurely born because a marijuana addicted woman normally are not strong enough to carry a baby for the whole nine months. Marijuana use during pregnancy can also increase the risk of stillbirth. Babies of mothers who use marijuana during their pregnancy also have issues with their neurological development when they come to this world. These problems include hyperactivity, impulsivity, executive function issues, sustained attention and memory issues, and much more. Well, these are all medical terms which you all might not be aware of. But in short, these babies are often not in the best health conditions. And due to what? Just smoking joints over the course of 9 months? This is very sad that some women don't even care about the new life which they will bring into this world and just for the sake of getting high for a few hours, they risk and, in many cases, destroy the life and health of their child. I request all the women out there, if you want to have some fun and you want to smoke a few joints, alright, but at least control yourselves when you're carrying a baby. And not just the baby. The mother of the baby also has to face some serious problems if they continue smoking weed during pregnancy. They are already carrying their baby and they are already weak. In this situation, there is also an increased risk of anemia, confusion, and forgetfulness. So it's not only the baby, but the mother is at stake too. Well, I hope I did make a point today in front of you guys. No matter how cool something looks, if it's not good for your health, you must avoid it. With that being said, we conclude this video. I hope you enjoyed the video. Don't forget to give it a thumbs up. Do leave your suggestions and remarks in the comment section. Follow the channel and press that bell icon so you don't miss out on any recent updates. I will meet you in the next video. Till then, take good care of yourself. Bye-bye.